So I've been getting a lot of questions about how do I get a TI-84 calculator onto my computer? Like the one shown right here to my left, it functions just like your, your calculator would if you had it in person. So you can still graph functions. You can still do whatever math applications you need to do. It functions just like your calculator would if you had it in your hand. The added bonus though, let's say you're doing a problem and you show all your work on the screen, you can take a snippet of it and paste that as your work. Or if you click on file, you can take a screenshot and save the image if you wanna do that with your work, whatever your calculator has. Maybe that means taking a screenshot of a graph, saving the image. Maybe it's taking a screenshot of uh, some type of matrix you created. You know, maybe you solved an equation using it and you want to just take a snippet of it. So I do like that quite a bit, this, this take a screenshot option. I also love to record a GIF. Let's say you want to show someone how to type something in. You can record like a little mini GIF to show them. Definitely think it's pretty awesome. So with that being said, I'll show you how to install it onto your Windows computer. So if you're checking out my video, if you scroll down to the description section, you'll notice two links. You need both. So I'm going to download this emulator. Okay, so you can click right here, or you're welcome to click right there. You'll download it. Click on the TI-84. This is the ROM for any of you emulator people out there, anyone who likes to play old video games on your computers, you know about emulators and ROMs. Download it. I imagine once you download it, it's going to be in your download section. So maybe you're like, I don't know how to get to my download section. If you click on the search box, you type in download. And right here, you should see downloads. You should see downloads here. Just click on the folder. This will pop up. Now, your images will have the same names. So one will say Wabitumu, and the other one will say TI-84PCSE. So this is your emulator, and this one is the ROM. What you want to do is right-click on the ROM file, the TI-84 file. You're going to go to open with. Okay. I imagine this is not there I because I said it. You're going to have to look for this file because you want to open up the TI-84 using this emulator. So what you want to do is click on always use this app and more apps. Scroll down. Look for another app on this PC. This box will pop up. Find downloads. And you'll see Wabbit to me. Click on it. Okay. Now you know that you should notice that this TI 84 should have a new image. It'll look like the TI 84 with a rabbit next to it. So the icon should change now. If you don't click that button to always select it, like with, don't forget to click this button. Otherwise, every time you want to open this document, you have to go through the process of finding it. You don't want to do that. You want it to always use that app, always use this emulator. So make sure you check off that box. Okay, now that you have it in the download section, my suggestion is place it somewhere you can easily find it. I literally dragged mine to my desktop. So you can just pick it up and just drag it right to your desktop. And then you'll have your TI-84 calculator right on your desktop anytime you need it. Feel free to drop a comment if you have any questions. I will answer them as I get them.